And developing right now, three people and a dog were able to escape a fire at a family-owned business on the south side. It happened at Mullins Memorial, a company that makes headstones on Mission Road, south of Southeast Military. News 4 San Antonio's Emily Bacham is there tonight. She joins us live where firefighters are still putting out those hot spots. Right, Emily? Right, and to give you the lay of the land, Elaine, we're across the street from San Jose Cemetery. This business has a couple of buildings back here. The fire started in the main building on the left and then spread to some of the smaller buildings. You can see the white smoke shows that firefighters have been out here a while putting fire or putting water, excuse me, on all those hot spots. The owner actually lives right next door. So he was the first one on the scene. He heard something that sounded like a pop, 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 ran outside and saw the flames. Meanwhile, firefighters just happened to be in the area when they spotted the smoke, so they immediately sprung into action. When they got here, that one building, the main building, was fully engulfed, so they worked to protect the other buildings on the property. The owner says three people made it out safely, plus their dog. But there is lots of damage to this business. The fire department estimates about $250,000 worth of damage. Uh, this is a, uh, a tombstone company, so they do a lot of engraving, granite work, that sort of thing. So a lot of expensive equipment, unfortunately, was lost here today. Mullins Memorial has been a family-owned business for two generations. They started back in 1971. The owner says it is just not safe for him to go back there yet and see the damage for himself. And he says he really does need to see it for himself to find out if any tombstones customers had ordered that he was working on are damaged. Meanwhile, the fire department still working to find the cause of the fire. The arson team is out here investigating just as a precaution. Reporting live on the south side, Emily Balkum, News 4, San Antonio.